in the postseason, that's where he's hit the bump in the road. 97 with that cheese. To get him back on the right track. Stevenson, Chanel. Got him swinging, nasty slider. A slider at 88. And that's a real good look at what makes Riley Farrell special. We saw the mid upper 90s fastball, but look at the slider just disappear at 88 miles an hour. The break on that just buries it at the back foot of that left-handed hitter. A good start for Farrell here in the ninth. Yeah, that clips the corner against Chinea. Farrell's one of those guys that's track guys to the big leagues. I think the stuff is outstanding, obviously, as long as. Got him swinging. Well, look like three straight sliders there to Chinea. Perfectly located down and away with the first two. He gets away with a bit of a mistake here. This one hangs up. Almost too much of a hanger. Almost too high and up and out of the zone. And Chinea kind of was a little fooled even by it. Look sharp here. And El Poche with two errors. Open up the door for two runs to score. And that's your ball game. TCU wins it. 10-3 the final. And the Horn Frogs with a big win to start their 2015 College World Series. Yeah, frustrating start for LSU who had Poche cruising, then the airs really opened the floodgates, but give TCU a lot of credit. Preston Morrison completely on top of his game and a lot of big clutch hits up and down the lineup for the Horned Frogs. We continue to see a lot of offense here in the College World Series. This